Hello there folks, my name is Spooks and I saw Trolls band together and I actually kind of loved it. I have had an interesting experience with this franchise. The first one I don't really care for. I think it's a pretty mediocre by the numbers kids film. But the second one really improved things for me. I actually enjoyed that one quite a bit. So I was definitely interested in seeing this third movie. The trailers looked pretty promising and you know with how things improved so much for me on the sequel I was hoping things would continue to improve with this franchise with this new one and they sure enough did i once again surprisingly enjoyed this way more than i thought i was as is accustomed with this franchise the best thing about this movie is the animation i just love the world they were able to create with everything is so felty it feels like this world was created out of like an arts and crafts book coming straight out of a michaels it's also colorful and vibrant i love the designs of the various different worlds and how they were able to make stuff like the sand and the water and all these various different environments all look so appealing and a feast for the eyes as well as amplifying the dance numbers in here they were all very well choreographed and a ton of fun to watch and the animators just did an overall fantastic job. They really knocked it out of the park here. I also found the story to be surprisingly well done here. Uh, this is definitely much more of a direct sequel to the first one as opposed to the prior one. Not wanting to disregard the second one as again I really enjoyed that Vovi. But if you were a fan of the first one and wanted to see a much more direct sequel to that. This is definitely that for you. It does a really good job of playing with... Uh, the certain boy band tropes as this is about Branch reuniting his former brothers who were all a uh, boy band at some point and it does a good job playing with those tropes and making the uh, pretty much getting the band back together type movie. This is uh, very investing, very engaging and a lot of fun to watch as you explore some of these worlds and get to see some of the other characters even some callbacks and some continuations uh, from the first film, which I was surprised, and I thought they handled all that stuff uh, really well. I, I was really invested with the movie. I also really liked the characters a lot in here. They're not the most groundbreaking characters in the world, but I don't know, just seeing all these characters interact and play off of one each other and going on this quest is just really entertaining. They're all so likable and charming, and the voice actors bring a ton of energy to each and every character here. Hell, I didn't even mind Amy Schumer which is definitely a godsend. The fact that I could stand Amy Schumer in a movie, that, that alone gives this movie like 20 extra bonus points. This movie is also hilarious. I laughed out loud and consistently several times throughout this movie. Just through the weird random jokes, just all of it just worked for me. It can even get really surreal and even trippy at times with one uh, sequence involving Do the Hustle that was so absurd and ridiculous. I just could not stop laughing. And it definitely fits in with the world uh, the filmmakers created. It just, it I don't know, the comedy just worked for me. It's just very, very funny. I can't explain it. I laughed a lot throughout the movie. And last positive thing I'll say about this is the musical numbers. I briefly touched that with the animation. And yes, the animators did a great job here. But the way they were put together in the movie and incorporated into the story, I felt they were really well done and just a ton of fun to watch and listen to the, the actual songs. I thought they were all well performed and well put together the songs in here were really great and the musical numbers that accompanied them were also really fun and entertaining to watch here as well now don't get ahead of yourselves folks this movie isn't perfect i still have a couple issues with this movie that hold it back for me first off i will say i do understand why some people may have problems with the story as i did feel after a while it did get a bit repetitive with going to search a brother have a dance number and then continue on with the journey i definitely felt that there i still was enjoying the movie for sure but i could definitely sense a repetition going on here and i also think the movie does lose a bit of steam near the end not to the point where i go okay this movie needs to end but like 
this resolution could have been a bit better. I also think that some of the jokes just didn't land. There are definitely some jokes where it's just the characters are talking really fast and are saying a lot of things, and that's the main joke. And some of the other jokes are just stupid for the sense of being stupid. And those jokes just didn't land quite as well as the other jokes that really struck with me. And I also think we could have spent a little bit more time with some of the other side characters. I feel like the movie may have struggled with too many characters here and there. Like, I think we could have devoted a bit more time to the dad. I won't say what happens with him in the movie for spoiler reasons but they could have definitely done more with his character especially with what's revealed as well as another character viva which again i won't get too much into spoilers but i really liked what they were going for her and i wish they did a little bit more with her because she was so entertaining and hearing a bit more about her really made me care a bit more into what was going on with the story i just wish we got a bit more time with that but even with those flaws, I still had a great time with Trolls Band Together. I'm as shocked as you are. I thought the animation was great, the story was great, characters, the jokes, the music, everything about it worked for me. I guess the basic way I can sum this up is if you like trolls not all of them but at least one of them uh if you're on board with the humor with the characters the music the energy and tone of it i'd say go check this out it's a t it's a ton of fun i think the kids are really gonna dig this and i think the parents and the general audience will also really get a kick out of this as well but if you don't really care for trolls, if you're not really into it, you think this is one of the weaker franchises for DreamWorks, stay away. This is definitely more of the same, really, and that's totally fine. But as for me, who liked someone who liked uh, the previous installment, I cannot recommend this enough. This honestly is my favorite out of the three, honestly. I'm surprised I'm even saying this, looking back on how much I didn't like the first one, and now I'm really praising this third one. Man, what a, what a comeback this franchise had for me. But yeah, I, I had a great time. I cannot recommend this enough. And those are my thoughts on Trolls Band Together. What did you all think of it? If you've seen it, did you like it? Did you hate it? Comment down below and let me know. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you like this channel, hit the subscribe button. Follow me on all the social media links at the end of the video. And until next time, everyone, stay sharp. Never not on my mind, oh my, oh my. I'm never not by your side, your side, your side. I'm never gonna let you What it is, it's a masterpiece Got a whole lot of love for them city streets Tonight is the place to be Got a big boombox and a new CD